Very I'm naughty. Angelique, by the way. Nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. You also seem to have brought along two other Oscar winner, Oscar nominee, Octavia Spencer and Naomi Watts. Do you feel like you joining the first one kind of made it more exciting of a prospect for them to join? Oh, I don't know. I hadn't really thought about that. Oh, I hope so. That would be nice. She didn't like shooting me. She didn't like holding that gun. Yeah. She'd sort of, you know, she'd hold it and she'd say, um, what's her last line that she says? Uh, you'll never find out. And she'd go, you'll never find out. Sorry. <laughs> you mentioned the royal baby. I was wearing my blue for Barden and obviously picked the wrong color because Kate had a girl. She had a girl. Yes, but the most important question, the hair. <laughs> let's talk about the fact that she looked better having this baby than she oh, even did she with clear, George. She'd clearly like done it already one time, you know what I mean? She literally walked out. Did you see her one arm hold the baby? Like, I got this. She was like <laughs> such a boss about it. It was like, oh yeah, I had this baby literally 10 hours. That's every, I have two kids. That's every <laughs> mom with the second kid. The first kid, you hold it like this. Oh, the second kid, you're like, whatever. Moving on, you've got it, you've got this. She clearly has got it. Rough times are rough times, hard times are hard times. When Bobby was talking about his daughter, he was visibly upset, but during the rest of the performance and when meeting fans, he was upbeat. E.T. is on the red carpet at the Hollywood premiere of Jupiter Ascending. We brought star Mila Kunis a little gift, a love note from her man, Ashton. We were on the set with Ashton today, three and a half men, and he recorded a little message for you. Can I show it to you real quick? Yeah. I think I'll just keep it simple and just say break a leg. <laughs> I know it's going to be amazing and you have nothing to be nervous about and you look stunning. I mean, how do you not love him, right? He's so great. Is he just up on daddy duty tonight? He just put her down to sleep. I gotta say, it sort of helped me with my aunt phobia a little bit because you while have watching it, that? yeah, I mean, I that one doesn't bother you, does it? Oh right well, <laughs> I wish that you would have told me that I had a friend here. Right there. Now I have to ask you about Paul. Do you think he was really worth passing the torch down to? I mean, well, no, I thought we made a terrible mistake. <laughs> uh, I mean, I, I mean, it's at one point we were asking uh, our Peyton, our director, said, "Now look." There seems to be some competition between my daughter, Evangeline Lilly, feeling like she should have had the torch passed down to her versus me choosing Paul. And I gotta tell you guys, I think the audience is gonna have a hard time accepting Paul because he's a wombat. You know, this guy is, you know, I mean, you know, and the, and the character he's playing. But Paul is your every man. There's no question about it. He is your every man. How I picked him, I'm not quite sure. Um, and he's not either, but he, Ultimately, and effective, just does, does a great job. Oh, I know how you picked him. He co-wrote the movie. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and he got the funny li lines too. Yeah. Yes, that wasn't fair. I didn't think so. Maybe in the next one, you'll have him get to have yeah, more. Yeah, I'll, I'll just stuff. learn how learn how to write overnight. Yeah. Now I know you keep a diary. What are you going to say about this day? What are you going to write? I know when I'll write. I'll be walking down here one night. Who knows where in the future? And I'm going to come up on it. Without even, without even looking for it, and that's gonna hit me, and I'll, I'll definitely write something down in. I threw popcorn in the air at uh, one point. It was not on purpose, it was pretty yeah. entertaining. Do you scream actual words, or you just scream? I scream, like, no, 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 don't go no, in there, no. don't do yeah. that, I do that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm very much like scolding, no, 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 no. What I loved recently that you just did was that 73 questions with Vogue. Oh, thanks. Particularly the studies contemporary in, studies in beatboxing. That's true, yeah. Can you uh, show me a little something? Sure, sure. <laughs> Nice to see you, Angelique. How's it going? Angelique Jackson for OMG Insider. Angelique Jackson Entertainment Tonight. Angelique, Angelique Jackson, The Insider.